we are rolling in the easy garage as you can tell from the title i want some help on this question and i'll let you know later on in the video what my question is i need um input from some of you collectors on how you display and collect but i um it's a various very curious question i have coming up so here's the blue cards again and we're going to finish this we're not going to finish it all in this video i think we uh finished off with this uh 192 corvette if i believe don't know if i did this row uh let's do it just just a recap if i didn't do it here's the old 442 w30 blister card number 267 there she is i don't think i did this row the blimp goodyear blimp 194 we'll uh whip through these um oh look at that sticker price on the on this uh protector pack now that's one of my that's part of the question these protector packs kind of goes with my answer from you guys i want your help so stay tuned and i will let you know my question this is 195 the troop convoy black wheels and a Porsche what is it Porsche 959 and it's blister card number 193 this came in three colors also a light there's the next one yeah a light so that's your dark pink looks like a lighter pink you can see the color right there for sure oh, there's another porsche oh, you guys didn't see that it's on a video a while back pretty rare check that one out here's 193 porsche and a looks to be a medium so that would be like a lot of these speed gleamers came out. So you can see your lighter, a little darker, and then your dark. Pretty much all the speed gleamers were like that. This one's an international card. It's not numbered, but I threw it on here because it was a blue card. Brown back. Your Peugeot 405. That's just in the mix. Split window Corvette number one, it's like 197. That one has the gray base, two rivets made in Malaysia. There's a bunch of variations on that one. There's another split window. Y'all have white walls 197. This one has a chrome base. And of course, the yellow protector. We gotta get it out of that. Up next, now, there's probably more Corvettes and more variations. These are not in order. I'm just making sure I'm putting them all in protector packs before I get them on the wall. Then I will put them in order. So 196, is that 196? One, yeah, 196. Three window, 34 basic wheel metal base here's the next one you can see there oh there's a couple of them there's another one yellow blister don't know what the variation is if it's a card no oh that's one has like a lighter fender and that one that was the variation and here's your pink fender which is a toughie pink fender 
And then the, the toughest one is like a a green. And I can't remember the uh, the fenders on it, but it's a uh, green body come from something else. And I had one. I sold it at a convention a long, long time ago. And I regret it. Here's your double demon. Blister card 199. Black with yellow. Path meter. Black hub. That's a tough variation there. 198. And here it is with your chrome hub. So there's your path beater with your common chrome hub wheels, chrome construction tires, I guess they call them. And there it is with black. Here's another Corvette. This one has basic wheels. Same number, 197. Uh, chrome, chrome base. But this one only has one rivet or spun it's only been spun once and it has a hook on the back compared to well let's see what this one is this one is oh this is a seven spoke with two rivets but you'll see the the back of it there is no um hook on the back we can see both of them see there's Looks like a license plate, and that one doesn't have it because of the one spin and the double spin. And that one also has a gray base, but it's a uh, five spoke. Come on, later on in the years, that one did. All right, so that's we wrap that row up. We're going to move down here, and um, let's do one row. And then I'll get into my question because I'm very curious. So now we're down here. We're looking at the Mercedes 380 SEL number 253 five spoke wheel metal base metal body. Those were cool. Pretty clean card on that one too. There's your Lamborghini Countach. Blister card number 60. Like, like I said, these aren't in order. I'll, I'll put them in order, and then we'll do a whole video uh, as they should lay after my question. Number 162, five-spoke wheel. Your alien. Not too hard to find. There's another one, ultra-hot. Ultra hot wheels versus five spoke. And let's see, what's this? Number 60, number 63, Radar Ranger. On your blue card. Last one up in this row. This one has a speed point package. VW Bug, number 65 in red really cool that model is neat i think there's some more variations so my question is so i i have all these the blue cards and as i'm putting them into protectors now i gotta buy a bunch more protectors before i get into this but i'm i want to get into um hanging these on the wall now these are all numbered cards too and they fit in with these, so you'll see it number uh, 210 with the uh, gold medal speed and all that. But the number will be another number. So do I, well, these are all going in protectors too, but do I mix them in with the blue or do I put catalog all these in number order and then start with the number order on these because they didn't have like a number one and all that. They just had different variations like a gold gold spoke wheel. 
So should I mix them in? So it'd be a white card, a blue and white card, and that just to keep the numbers together? Or should I do a blue card only and then start these at the lower numbers? Because I have about, you know, there's probably gonna be about 200 of these that have to go up there. So this would be 130, 136. Do I have a 136 on hand? No. But should I put that with the with the um, 136s? Or just keep all the blue and white cards separate? How would you do it? How would you do it? That's, that's my question. All right, we'll do a couple more here. Oh, this is a toughie with seven spoke wheels. Especially with now the Ferraris, you guys love them. And seven spoke blister card number 226, Ferrari 348, a T bucket, little lower number, number 68, another Ferrari for you Ferrari guys, number 69, Ferrari F40. <clears throat> Your Bronco number 56. I don't know how the lower numbers got pushed way down here. Number 156. That's cool. Rodzilla. But that one has this is a tough one with the SHO wheels. Usually you find it with the uh, Ultra Hot wheels. And what's up after this one is a Big Bertha, number 79, a mini truck, number 89. I would love to find this car. Look at that new model. I'd love to find this on this card with the SHO wheels. It's pretty tough and little pricey little pricey this one must be an international you can find it on a number card but this is just an international card t-bird stalker number 28 avis quattro 208 with five spokes and a ford 32 Ford Delivery, number 67. And that one, I have that. And there's probably more. And there's your uh, same car. I'll pull it out. It is the, uh, they call them prototype packages. There's only a few different models that came with these, this type of packaging. But they do fit in with the blue card. So that goes back to, I put these in there with them. But why would I not put the um, blue and whites mixed in with the numbers? Just curious, but I love that package. Or should I separate those also and put them up near the uh, near the end of um, what year? 98? Or no, my 98. Man, I'm going way back. 89, so it'd be... This would be around 1990. Let's see. Let's see what the copyright was. Yeah, it'd be uh, 19. Let's focus in there. That'd be 1989. No, it'd be 1990 when that hit the shelf. If you could find them. All right. Couple more. GM Lean Machine. 268 this had wheel variations you got to look up in there that one looks like it's uh ultra hot wheels treditor 205 not a big deal vector aftec i'll call it aftec wx3 number 207 that one had some variations I think a lighter, a light and a dark. You can see it there. 
even through the yellow blister, you can see the variation. Pipe jammer, and that is uh, 206 in yellow. And here's another Treditor in your lime color. I remember the first red one I found when it came out. I thought it was pretty cool right there. Um, I found that at Target. We went, we went down south one time. Oh, is that card all messed up? Oh, no, that's the vector. Um, we went down to Target down in Fort Lauderdale one time, and that was the first time I seen it. I grabbed it. I was like so excited. So we're going to finish these up. And I do have another box of blue cards to add to this, but I don't have the protectors. So we're going to leave this at that. I hope you guys answer my question. How would you do it? How would you do it? Would you mix these in somewhere in there with the number that it's corresponding to? Or would you just leave the blues and then start the lowest number of these and start a start another row. But these are all these are all going in protectors. There's probably oh I don't know how many I got. Another 200 cars there, and probably another 50 blue cards I gotta put in protectors out of another box. But I appreciate you guys watching. Thanks for watching and subscribing. Make sure you hit that subscribe, hit the like, leave a comment, and thank you guys. Stay easy. Don't forget, keep on turning Hot Wheels.